Hello everyone. Welcome in the fourth part of the chapter Giving Theory or Wetting Line Theory. In this part, we are going to learn about the classification of giving models. So basically, giving models are classified into 12 types. Now what the 12 types are and how they are representing the giving models, let us see. The first giving model is model first or it is also called Erlang model. The symbolic representation of this Erlang model is M M1 is to FCFS infinity infinity. Now already we have seen in the third video of this chapter that the first symbol it represents the arrival rate, second symbol representing the service rate, third symbol representing third symbol representing the number of service channels, fourth symbol representing the type of service discipline used in the system, fifth one representing the number of customers allowed in the system whether they are finite or infinite and last one representing the type of population whether it is finite or infinite or it is also called calling sources. So now here the symbol M first M it is representing poison arrival or exponential inter arrival distribution representing M or the symbol M it is representing poison arrival as well as exponential inter arrival distribution but generally in the giving problems exponential inter arrival is rarely used generally used distribution is poison poison distribution second m it is representing poison departure or exponential service time distribution now in the giving models generally the second m it is representing the exponential service time distribution instead of poison distribution or poison departure number one it is representing the number of ser service channels or number of server channels in the system as number one is there it is representing there is a single server channel in the system fcfs it is the long form of first come first serve so what type of service discipline is here? The service discipline is first come first served. Second, after that, this infinity it is representing the number of customers allowed in the system. So infinity representing infinite customers are allowed in the system. Second infinity is representing the number of calling sources in the system or the population of the system. So it is infinite infinity or it is infinite population in the system now let us see the second model it is also called general erlang model now model 2 is same as that of model 1 or the representation symbolic representation of a model 2 is same as that of model first that is m m1 is to fcfs infinity infinity now the meaning of all these symbols are same as that of model first. Now what is the difference between model first and model second? The arrival and service rates are depend upon the length of the queue. In case of model 2, whatever the arrivals are there, whatever the service rate, services are there, service is there, their rates are completely dependent on the length of queue. Now, here the length there may be chances of varying the length of this queue how it is varying so some persons may not join the queue since it is too long which affects the arrival rate service rate is also affected by the queue length as the queue length is varying why it is varying because some persons who are going to take the service because of having too high the length of queue they will not join the queue and it will affect 
on the arrival rate as well as on the service rate model third the symbolic representation of third model is m m1 is to 0 s i r o infinity infinity the meaning of m m1 is same same there will be poison arrival there will be exponential service distribution zero means service in random order so type of discipline is random type of discipline is there randomly the customers will be taken for the service one representing single server channel this infinity infinity they are representing same that is infinite population will be allowed last one representing and this one is representing infinite customers are allowed in the system model fourth the representation symbolic representation of model fourth is m m1 is to fcfs n infinity now here m m1 they are representing same poison arrival distribution exponential service time distribution one single service channel first come first serve discipline n it is representing finite customers are allowed in the system so only finite number of customers will be allowed in the system so the example which we have taken in the earlier videos the example of motor garage as there are limited number of parkings in the garage the customers will be allowed in the system till that parking gets fulfilled once it is fulfilled further customers are not allowed to join the system so that type of examples included in this model infinity representing infinite population anyone can join the queue before it is fulfilled model fifth symbolic representation of this model is m m1 is to fcfs n m now here these symbols are same which we have seen earlier now this n it is representing potential amongst m customers are allowed in the system so there are only finite number of people who have called for the service so there is finite population here we can see that m representing finite population amongst that m customers only n number of potential customers will be allowed in the system model 6 symbolic representation of this model is m m c is to f c f s infinity infinity now here the c it is representing there is a multi server channel system there is a parallel multi server uh, channel system remaining symbols are representing the same as that we have seen earlier then model 7 the symbolic representation of model 7 is m e k 1 is to f c f s infinity infinity now e k it is representing a long service time with k phases so service distribution is represented by a long service time with k phases model 8 the representation of this model it is given here m m 1 is to g d m n now here what is the meaning of g d it is representing the service discipline it is general service discipline m representing finite customers are allowed in the system only finite customers are allowed to join in the system n representing the finite population so there is finite population there is finite calling customers as well as there is finite customers who are allowed to join the system now here one thing is important m must be less than or equal to n whatever the customers are allowed to join the queue in the system 
it must be less than or equal to the total po population of the system that means <coughs> n now it represents machine repair problem here the example it is given machine repair problem with single repairman n is the total number of machines out of which m are broken down what this one is representing one it is representing there is only one service channel that means if the machine shops example we have taken then there are m number of broken down machines total number of machines are n and for the repairing of that n machines there is only a single repairman then model 9 the symbolic representation of this model is m m c g d m n now this c it is representing multi repairman in the previous model we have seen the number of repairments were only one here the repairmen are more than one so they are c gd representing general service discipline m representing finite customers are allowed in the system n representing finite population now here m should be less than or equal to n and the number of repairmen should be again should be less than or equal to the number of customers who have called for the service so that means finite population model 10 it is called the power supply model now what this model that we will see in the coming videos later model 11 the symbolic representation of this model is dd1 fcfs infinity infinity now what this d representing it is representing inter arrival time is fixed and known with certainty so inter arrival time it is fixed and it is known with certainty earlier models we have seen there is random time at arrival and it is represented in the form of probability distribution poison distribution we have seen for the arrival and for the departure or for the service we have seen exponential distribution so like that here the fixed time is there and the certainty is known so inter arrival time is known second d representing service time is also fixed and known with certainty one representing single service channel fcfs first come first serve discipline infinity infinite customers are allowed in the system and second infinity representing infinite population in the system last model its a symbolic representation is md1 fcfs infinity infinity first d sorry here it is not d it is m just i will make the change here so this one is poison inter arrival distribution second d it is service time is fixed and known with certainty single server channel first come first serve discipline infinite customers are allowed in the system and infinite population so friends in this way we have seen the classification of giving models so 12 types here we have seen along with their symbolic representation and their meaning so in the coming videos we will see few models amongst that we have discussed whatever we have discussed few models we are going to discuss in detail and we are going to analyze that models so thank you for watching this video